Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Lane, and welcome back to Madden 18 Career Mode using Aaron Rodgers. We're in Week 5 playing against the 3-1 and one Dallas Cowboys, so let's hop right in. Now, this should be a tough game. We are 2-2, two and two, but we played the Seattle Seahawks and the Falcons in Week 1 and Week 2, and they have great offenses, so that's kind of why I'm worried about the Dallas Cowboys because obviously they got Prescott, they got Elliott, Des Bryant, Jason Witten. Granted, most of the people I just listed aren't on the team anymore, but first to 10, we're getting the ball first. Let's see what we can get right to the other team. Sean Lee with that interception. Wow, great start to the game. So it's 7-0 already, 420 left in the game. That was an atrocious interception. That's basically how we lost week one and week two. So as I was saying before, Des Bryant's not on the team anymore. Jason Witten just retired the other day. So they're kind of losing their pieces, and I don't even think Dak Prescott's that good. Sorry if you're a Cowboy fan, but... I feel like he did good season one because of Elliott. Then they lost him in season two. Or not lost him, but he was suspended for a little bit. And that's kind of why they fell off. Wow, nobody's open. Let's get it right to RB. I guess he's, wow, that's way, way out of bounds. But I really do feel like Dak Prescott, not that he's a bad quarterback or anything like that, but I feel like he's average and he really needs that running game to be anything. Kind of like Russell Wilson. That I don't really think Russell Wilson's that great. He just had a great D. Or, see, I'm making it sound like he's bad. They're not bad. But the, people act like they're like top five QBs, and I really don't think so. I just think they have a good running game, like Russell Wilson and Marshawn Lynch. And then they both had, or I guess the Cowboys didn't have a great defense. Seattle did, obviously, but the Seattle also won a Super Bowl, and the Cowboys haven't done that in a, in a while, one might say. Oh, God, I thought we were getting rushed. Jamal Williams down to the 29-yard line, 30-yard line. Okay. I just did a realistic rebuild of the Green Bay Packers, and they're not as bad as I thought they were. Jamal Williams, he did a lot. So Ty Montgomery actually must still be hurt. Uh, but they have a great defense that I really didn't expect because you would just assume they're like, oh, well, they have Aaron Rodgers, so they're all right. But no, nope, they get a pretty good defense. We have a third and five play right here. We are going to have to get a first down. Maybe Martellus Bennett is going to get some separation. No, he's not. All right, we're going to have to punt the ball. Great. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. It is 14 to nothing. So it looks like we're passing the rest of the game. So first and 10 right here. I'm going to try to get it to Jamal Williams unless Devontae Adams can get wide open. It just, like, the, the Cowboys aren't known to have a good secondary, so I'm kind of surprised. Or a good defense, period. Oh, there's Jordy Nelson. Oh, wow. I thought that was right to the other team. But they're not known to have a good secondary. Not really even a good defense whatsoever. Sean Lee's good. I think they have Orlando Skandrick in here, who's not really that bad. But it really shouldn't be 14 to nothing. That's the best way I could put that. So let's just try to do something short and sweet. There we go. Who is that? Adams across the middle. Did he get the first down? No, nine-yard gain. Not bad, though. Not bad. It's third and one. We just got to get some yardage because if we punt it again and they score, this game will pretty much be over. There's 50 seconds left in the first quarter, though. Let's try to hit Devontae Adams again, maybe. Oh, yeah. Wide open. Keep You drop the ball. Really? Did he drop it or did someone intercept that? Okay, we dropped it. Hey, our defense made a stop. And why did they pick an HB screen on the one-yard line? All right, I don't usually audible, but we have to audible out of this or we're going to take safety. I really can't let that happen. So first in time, we have to be quick too. Oh, not really. No, they're not really rushing us. Okay, that's good. Jordy Nelson probably with that first down, right? Yes, first down. It's good that our defense finally made a stop, though. So we have a first and 10, still down by 14. We did get the ball first, though, which is a little bit of a problem, but hopefully you can score quick here and get the ball back before halftime. Hopefully they don't score once they get the ball back. Uh, no one's really open. That's good. It looks like I'm going to take off and run a little bit. Oh, no, 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 no. Really? Oh, I didn't see the guy coming to the left side of the screen. Wonderful. 21 to nothing with four and a half minutes left before halftime. Before halftime. This is going to have to be the most epic comeback of all time. And none of our guys get open. So probably won't happen. Let's roll out a little bit to the right side. Get rid of that ball. No, really? You know, I went into this career mode with Aaron Rodgers. I was like, this is going to be pretty easy. Aaron Rodgers is good. He's got great wide receivers, a good running back. Uh, the offensive line's not too, too bad, but we are getting wrecked by every single good team. So we have a second and 18 right here. What did that say? I, another sack. Are you out of your mind? What is our drive goal? We need a score. You don't say. Third and 26. So we're about to punt the ball unless Kendricks or Adams can get super wide open. Doesn't look like they're going to. Somebody on the right side of the field just sitting there. Okay, let's get rid of that ball. I don't know what Jamal Williams. Why did you cut in? If he just kept running straight, we would have had that first down. But I guess we're punting it. Hey, our defense made a stop. 
It's first and 10, a minute 18 left before halftime. We're on the 12-yard line, so we have some work to do. Uh, can we at least get three points before the end of the half? That'd be great. There's Jordy Nelson wide open, and he dropped it. Great. What do you guys think this final score is going to be? Because I don't even know if we're going to score a touchdown. This is really bad right now. We have a second and 10, a minute 10 left before halftime. Let's try to get somebody, anybody open. No, there's nobody open. This is so bad. I guess our B's open. Who is that? Devontae Adams. Okay, okay. Stay on your feet. No, okay. Let's call a timeout. First and 10, a minute left before halftime. Still down 21 to nothing, obviously. Let's see, let's see. Adams or Jordy Nelson, who's we're going to have to throw it to? That was a sentence. Uh, let's see. No one's really getting open. This is so aggravating. I'll get it right there to Devontae Adams. Not going to be a big gain. Still on his feet. No, he fell down. Damn. All right, let's do the double slot cross. Who's way downfield? Is that Randall Cobb? He's really not that fast. I don't know why he's going deep every time. We probably should have Adams going deep, but so be it. Here we go. First and 10. Oh, there we go. Jordy Nelson. Ooh, and he held on to it. Okay, timeout. First and 10, 19-yard line, 31 seconds left. Didn't mean to say it that way. I was going to say 19 seconds left, but I started reading the wrong thing. But we have a first and 10, like I said. We have to take a shot downfield relatively soon. Oh, no. We're getting rushed. We're getting rushed. We're getting rushed. Go, 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 go. Get out of bounds. We're not fumbling it again. Second and inches, 24 seconds left, and we are on the nine-yard line. I feel like we might have to run this in right now, but I want to get it to Jamal Williams if we can. I also want to say, oh, get rid of that ball. Get rid of that ball. Jamal Williams. Touchdown to make it 21 to 7. That's a good way to rally back and get some points before halftime. Nice, nice, nice. They did not score a touchdown after halftime or even before halftime. I guess they had 15 seconds. But it's the third quarter, 444 left in the third. I hate the corner strike oh so much. But I guess that's what the coach called up. So that's what we're going to do. Good old Mike McCarthy. Let's just get out of bounds. I cannot fumble this ball again. Look at the bottom down there. Oh, it just went away. The Vikings are 0-4. The Bears are 1-3. And we're 2-2. and Who's the other team in our division? The Bears, Vikings. Uh, what? Bears, Vikings, Packers. Wow. I'm so dumb that I can't think of what the fourth team is. I can't believe I can't figure this out. It's so obvious, too. It's, pro it's not staring me in the face. It's not the Cowboys. Who is that fourth team? Oh, the Lions. That's who I'm trying to think of. All right, what do we get to? The 39-yard line? There we go. So for all I know, we could be in first place with a 2-2 two two record. I'm kind of looking down below at the ticker, see if we can see what the Lions are. We played the Lions already, I believe. Did we do that last video? I haven't recorded this in a few days, so I don't remember. But we have a second and one play, 3.30 left in the third quarter. We kind of actually do have to move somewhat quickly. A is wide open, Devontae Adams down to the 30. Yes. First and 10, three minutes left in the third quarter. We have Janice and Cobb and ben, uh, Bennett going across. I wanted to call him Bennett. I don't know why. Let's see. Ma oh, Janice is wide open. There you go. Down to the 15. First and 10 on the 16, down by two touchdowns. I feel like we'll get a touchdown out of this drive. So we'll only be down by one, and hopefully our defense can make a stop. I still don't really see the Lions down there, so let's just let's not pay attention to that right now. First and 10. Oh, right there, right. Ooh, nice play. Right. Wow. Second and 10, 223 left in the third quarter. What are we looking at? Maybe Bennett or Nelson going across the middle. I just, I don't want to kick a field goal. Oh, get rid of that ball. There you go. Jordy Nelson, get in the end zone. Down to maybe the three. Yeah, the three-yard line. No. Is Jordy Nelson injured? Jordy Nelson is not injured, but we have a first and goal on the three-yard line. We're going to try to run it in with Jamal Williams. Get in there. Yes, touchdown. That is going to make it 21-14. Williams' second touchdown of the day. This is a pretty good comeback right now. It is 21-14. They just turned the ball back over. So we have a minute 16 left in the third quarter. Let's try to tie this ball game up. All right, first and 10. We have Ben in the fullback position. He might be a good guy to go to. I guess not. No! Lay me alone! Get out of bounds. Second and inches, 50 seconds left in the third quarter. So we have the whole fourth quarter to play with right now. But we have a second and inches. I'm feeling probably just Jordy Nelson for a nice, safe pass. Let's roll out a little bit. Oh, uh, there we go. X is wide open. There we go. Devontae Adams down to the 20-yard line. Did get tackled, though. I thought he was going to get by him. Okay, his guy's injured, not Adams. Good. I finally saw it. The Lions are 2-3, and three, so technically, if we win this game, we will be in first place. We might actually be in first place right now, but obviously, we're going to win or lose. I guess we could draw. Technically, I don't think that's going to happen. First and 10. Let's get this going. First and 10, what are we looking at? 
98 is always on my ass. Just step out of bounds. We cannot fumble this. This will probably be the last play of the third quarter. We have a second and five on the 16-yard line. We're doing the double-triple slant. I guess it's actually only a double slant. I don't know why they call the other one the double slant. Oh, Jordy Nelson with the touchdown. That should tie up the ball game, 21-21. All right, all right. So it is 24-21 with 4.06 left in the game. So we need a field goal to tie, a touchdown to be in the lead. But we also don't want to waste, or rather, we do want to waste a lot of time so they don't get the ball back. But obviously there's a big play right here and there's someone just so wide open that it'd be dumb not to throw it to him. Oh! Oh, A is wide open, too. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. That is ugly. I had Devontae Adams on that play so wide open, it wasn't even fair. Where is Adams? Adams on the right side. Okay. So we have Cobb going across the middle, Bennett going across the middle. Maybe Janice, that's who they want me to throw it to. I don't like that. I really, really don't like that. We are going to get tackled from behind the 29-yard line. Third and six. Is it four down territory? I feel like it should be. But I don't know if they're actually going to make it like that. So let's try to get this first down. Our really only option is maybe Bennett or Jordy Nelson on the left side. Of course Cobb, but he's realistically not going to get open. There we go. Jordy Nelson for the first down. First and 10 on the 42-yard line. We have 315 left in the game. Let's try to get it to Bennett across the middle. Oh, why is everybody so covered? We're just going to have to run it again for a first down. Get out of bounds. We did fumble it. Yikes. First and 10, 308 left in the game. We're at about midfield or a little bit past it, I guess. Uh, we're going to try. We're running the Y sale play, so we're going to try to get it to Bennett right here. Maybe Jamal Williams. Actually, we're going to have to get rid of that real quick. No way. Jamal Williams, are you serious? How easy of a catch was that? He was wide open. He could have ran for days, and he drops it. So we have a second and 10 right here, 305 left in the game. We have to get one of these Adams. Or, or is that Bennett? That's actually Bennett. There we go. You dropped it. Another drop. Are you kidding me? Here we go, third and ten. There probably will be a fourth down in this if we don't get the first down. So we don't have to really rush, make a bad decision, anything like that. But third and ten, we have Nelson going across the middle. Adam's going to go and then cut in or cut out, I guess, is the best way to put that. Let's see, let's see, let's see. No one's really open. Oh, I guess Adams is open. Adams, you better catch that. Thank you. First down. We are wasting a good amount of the clock. Where we are, We're going to leave him with under two minutes, obviously, unless we score right here. I can't imagine that's going to happen, even when we're running the four verticals like this. But... If they have like a minute and a half left, that'll be great. Especially because we, all we have to do is kick the field goal. So I'd be smarter just to run it right here. Yeah, we're just going to run it. We're going to slide inbounds, go down to the two-minute warning. Second and six, a little under a minute and a half left in the game. We were running the four vertical play. I would love just to get a first down. We don't really have to go for that touchdown quite yet. Yeah, we're just going to run it. We're going to run it to right here. We're going to slide. What is that, the six-yard line? Okay, good. So we're getting down here to the nitty-gritty. We can kick a field goal just going to overtime. But with 40 seconds left, I'd love just to score a touchdown here, and hopefully they don't do the, do the same. Oh, right there, right there. Ooh, he's out of bounds. I thought I had that touchdown right here, but I think he stepped out of bounds first before he caught it, which that puts you out of the play. I don't really understand how that works, but so be it. So we have a second and goal play. Well, I kind of get it, actually, because in theory, you could just run along the sideline just way out of bounds, and it's, it's weird. But we have a second and six play right here. Do we go to Jamal Williams for his third touchdown of the game? Yes, we do. Touchdown to Jamal Williams to make it 28-24. That was such an epic comeback. We were down 21-0 in the second quarter, and we come back to win it 28-24. Let's check out the stats real quick. Rodgers went 17 for 28 for 268, three touchdowns and interception, a 113 passer rating, not bad. Dak Prescott, 18 for 30 for 201, two touchdowns and an interception. That's really not that bad. I mean, it's kind of like an average, but... Let's see what Elliott did, I guess. 24 rushes, 95 yards with a touchdown. He also had a fumble. Aaron Rodgers, 9 for 83 with a fumble. Not the most realistic thing in the world. Jamal Williams, 2 rushes for 7 yards with a touchdown. Let's look at receiving. Devontae Adams, 6 for 120. That's a great game. Jordy Nelson, 5 for 81 with a touchdown. Dez, 5 for 79. Jason Witten, 5 for 55 with 2 touchdowns. That's great. Jamal Williams, 4 for 44 with 2 touchdowns. Cole Beasley, 3 for 34. Nothing else really there to look at. So, if you guys like this video, give it a like down below. Make sure to check out my channel. Subscribe for daily Madden 18 content hit that bell to be notified when all my videos go live and i will see you guys in the next one thank you so much for watching bye